Hey guys, Shane here. Just wanted to do a uh, quick update. Um, rig's been online now for about 24 hours. I have done some adjustments, um, but it really hasn't helped out that much. I think I gained, um, right here in Simple Miner, I think I gained like three hash. But I actually just noticed, um, maybe 10 minutes ago, the rig actually crashed. So I'm probably gonna have to redo these settings. You know what, I might as well do that now, put them back to the way they were. Let me go over here, I can overclocking. It was 1168, comma 1168. These are both 1750, comma 1750. Let me scroll down, and my fan speed is actually at about 50% earlier. So let me hit save. So now the rig should reboot and it'll come back and show us right here 1168, at least it should, 1168, 1750, and 1750. Uh, the cards are running really cool, so that's fine the way that's set up. I think I've made so far to the leave. Well, it's not even been 24 hours, but it's it's right around a dollar right now I've made, which isn't much for two RX 560 cards. But again, you know, I'm just messing around with it. I actually did find somebody on eBay, and I purchased it for six bucks. He claims to have a BIOS hack for the cards. Um, and his screenshot showed 400 hash. You know, I'm mining Zcash right now. So he was saying 400 hash per card. So if I can, you know, I got two cards, so I'll be 800 hash. If I can even get half that, that's still about 150 more than I'm getting now. So six bucks, if that's the case, that's a pretty good spend. I'll definitely let you guys know on that one. Uh, here's the console, see the rigs rebooting, changing the uh, overclock settings. So it should be coming back online here. There we go, we're back online. That'll probably drop just a little bit. Cards 49 and 43, so that's booting back up, so that's good. Um, let me actually go over here to eBay and see what my cards are I'm bidding on. I think I've been outbid by every one of them right now. I may have one left and I'm still scroll down. Okay, so I'm still got the winning bid on this one. There's one out bid. Got the winning bid on that one. That's two. So I got three cards for me right now. That I could be winning. The 127 right there, 145. I'm just gonna let those go. 122, probably gonna let that go. Still got three days, 142, I'm letting that go. So I still got three, maybe four chances to get a, uh, a new card for the rig, maybe two. So that'll be pretty cool. Uh, I'm sure you guys know today on markets, uh, complete garbage. I saw it this morning when I got up as low as 7,800. Terrible. Uh, but I took that as an opportunity to buy some cards low. I bought some more Cardano here uh, at 33 cents I think it was and I actually bought Stellar. Bought some Stellar as well. Just added to my altcoin portfolio. So I actually found those the settings for I, that I was using for these cards. Yeah there's my hash has dropped down to 250 right now. I found those settings in uh, Bitcoin Talk Forum that I was using earlier. That seemed to be working pretty good until it rig crashed, like I said, maybe 20 minutes ago now. Um, so hopefully that guy's BIOS hack will work pretty good for me. Like I said here, I'm mining on uh, Mining Pool Hub, I'm mining Zcash, and I'm converting it to script right now, Verge script. Because Verge, let me see. It's pretty low right now, five cents. And that's been as much as, let me see. 
see. Let me scroll down. Let me zoom out. So, Verge has been as high as 20 cents. So, as long as it's so low right now, I'll convert it to that. And it looks like it's been averaging, you know, anywhere from 15, 15 to 20 cents. So if I can get it back up to that average and get a bunch of coins, you know, at the five cent point, that'll be a nice, nice turnaround. That'll be, if it gets it back up to 20 cents, that'll be, you know, 400% gain, right? Four times gain. Anyways, guys, um, that is my rig mining update for today. Um, I did actually, let me go to one more thing. Let me see if I can log in real quick. Let me go over to Hash Flare. Okay, so we're in my Hashflare account. Um, I've actually been reinvesting in, um, what is that, Ethereum script? Because I found that reinvesting in SHA-256 here, the fees, I mean, they usually say the pool fees are like 17%. I was finding them as high as 26%. So, that's crazy. Whereas Ethereum uh, does not have those fees. There's no fees here, so I'm not making much, but three mega hash so far have, uh, has been re reinvested into it for my profits from my uh, SHA-256. So that's what I've been doing with my hash flare mining. Um, so anyways, guys, Thanks for watching. Be sure to like, subscribe to the channel, hit the bell icon, especially if you're new here. Um, trying to get my subscriber base up to 5,000 this year, and uh, you guys can help out by subscribing, all right? I will see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.